My name is Chase Allen, and I run the Ironfish Gallery out of my home. I specialize in creating handcrafted coastal sculptures, mermaids, fish, crabs. I live on Defusky Island, South Carolina. We're a bridgeless island, so it's pretty special. We don't have grocery stores. We don't even have paved roads. So I graduated with a business degree and joined a real estate group, and they were a little bit cutthroat, so it was all about sales and trying to get people to buy things, whether or not they wanted it or needed it. In my opinion, it wasn't a very genuine way to make a living. I was very unhappy, and that's kind of what pushed me to become a metal artist and sort of chase that dream. When I opened in 2001, so I made these 10 designs and put them on the porch, and they started to sell. It's awesome to support myself as a professional artist. It's important to me to have everything handcrafted. There's always going to be slightly different hammer marks, sizes, finished products. It's never going to be exactly the same. Nothing's ever going to be exactly the same because it's made by hand. I have probably over 350 or 400 designs of ironfish sculptures. I to sort of hide my signature in the eye, so the eye is my initial. The only place for gallery space was the wraparound porch. I realized I couldn't close when I go out of town or go for groceries, and that kind of started the honor system. And they leave money under the door. I always pinch myself when people buy something. It's special that people want to put pieces that I created out of a sketchbook or out of an idea, and, and they want to decorate their homes with it. It's, it's great, and it's humbling. The fact that I did take a risk, and that I did go against the grain, and I did not follow the herd, that is the most rewarding thing about what I do.